Space and the Shuttle thing. I've always been excited by space travel, and today is the 40th anniversary of the Apollo 11 launch. Now, Apollo 11 was the ship that brought Neil Armstrong, Buzz Aldrin, and Michael Collins to the moon. Uh, it took four days because of the obstacles that were in the way, of course. Uh, do we have a map of the route they took? If you watch, look at this. Uh, see, they took off from Cape Kennedy there. Then they had a layover at Newark. And then after Newark, they go up and they're over around the uh, Death Star there. And then Buzz Aldrin was angry because they lost his luggage. And you don't, you don't want to make Buzz Aldrin mad. Uh, Buzz Aldrin once hit a guy for saying the moon landing was fake. I know some people actually believe the moon landing is fake. These people are called, the technical term is called jerks. Uh, the moon landing was fake. Oh, shut your hole. Fake a moon landing? It's not an orgasm. You can't fake a moon landing. Oh, you've landed, you've landed. Oh, oh, touchdown. Oh, oh, one small step for a man. You can't fake a moon landing. It's not an orgasm. It's not a, it's not a talk show host's enthusiasm for some actor's crappy movie. You can't fake a moon landing. said too much. Anyway, it must be great, though, to look up the moon and say, I've been there. That's, that's what I do when I see Fabio on TV. <laughs> it's a joke. It's a joke. Back in the 1960s, the way, uh, 1960s, America was racing to get to the moon before the Russians, because the Russian space program back then was very competitive. They actually sent a dog into space. The dog was like... <laughs> Like, the dog didn't want to go. He's very reluctant. It was like, rrr, 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 are you crazy? <laughs> so what they did was they got a rock together and they fired a frisbee up first, and then the dog was like, rrr, rrr. it all worked out. Anyway, we haven't we haven't been to the moon since 1972, and I'm thinking, oh, why not? <laughs> yes, it's money. See, if we ever find oil in the moon, we'd be back there faster than. We'd be back there faster than ice cream goes to my ass. It would be faster than Ryan Seacrest to a fabric sale. We'd be faster than faster than Bill Clinton to a peep show. Faster than Jay Leno go back to 11:30 on NBC. Faster than all of that. I said it. That's right. I said it. I mean, might pretend I don't live in America. Well, I don't know what's going on. I'm just a guy on TV. <laughs> what am I talking about? Oh, yeah. It, look, oh, if we find oil in the moon, we go back. Or if we find water in the moon, that'd be great. We could bottle it and sell it to yuppies in Los Angeles. <laughs> moon water would, would make a fortune in LA. It's 10% of the weight of regular water. 